Welcome to High Wycombe, situated in the rolling countryside of the Chiltern Hills, laying in the valley of the River Wye, at one time known as the furniture capital of England, but now sadly isn't. Today we focus on the work undertaken by the plucky team at the High Wycombe Repair Café. They offer their experience and expertise in restoring broken and damaged cherished treasures, initially and unsuccessfully attempted by inexperienced bunglers. Here we see local resident Mr. A engaging in the hobby of horology. It's his way of passing the time. <laughs> Oh dear, Mr. A, what have you done now? Well, Mr. A, you know where you should have gone? Yes, indeed, Mr. A, the High Wycombe Repair Café. Lordy, lordy, Mr. A is at it again. This could have electrifying consequences. <laughs> Mr. A, I think you should have taken it to the boffins at the repair cafe. What's volts and amps can be a shocking business. <laughs> Taking out milk bottles at the end of the day is a chore in many households across the country, and it's not without its mishaps. Oh, cripes. Well, it seems Mr. A will be off to the repair cafe again to see the lovely ladies in the sewing bee corner. This afternoon, Mr. A is visited by his daughter Corinne and granddaughter Olivia. It's a playful time. What could possibly go wrong? What to do indeed, Corinne? How about you pop along and see the splendid group of enthusiastic volunteers at the Repair Café? Well, another satisfied person as Mr. A leaves the High Wycombe Repair Café. Cheerio, everybody! Oh no, you're in a pickle now, Mr. A. At least you're in the right place to return to the Repair Café. They might even mend your bag. Cheerio, all!